Hey, it's Greg here using the new Opus Clip AI voiceover feature. It lets you type in your own voiceover script like this, or it can even generate the script for you. So let me show you how to do both of those things inside the new voiceover tool. Okay, so we'll start with how to type in your own script and have the voiceover say that. You need to be inside the editing screen here for a video to be able to type in your voiceover script and add your AI voice to it. And to type in that script, you simply click on the voiceover button over here. And in this new area that's just appeared, we'll be able to type in our voiceover script here, choose a speaker voice for our voiceover, and then also change the volume settings. So I've just typed in this short script here that I want the voice over to say. I'm now gonna scroll down and choose my speaker voice by clicking this box. There's up to 20 voices to choose from and you can preview any of them by pressing a play button over here. So let's preview Daniel. The world is round and the place which may seem like the end may also be the beginning. That's a great British accent, so let's go with that. And if we scroll down, we'll see this volume slider that we need to choose a level for. And this volume slider here doesn't actually control the volume of the voiceover that we're adding. It actually sets how loud you want the original video to be underneath the voiceover. So I'll just show you what it's like at 100%. We'll press generate speech to see that setting. You'll see that the voiceover has now been added down here on the timeline at the start. And if I press play on the timeline, you'll be able to hear the problem with setting the video volume to 100%. Listen to this. Hi, I this is am Greg, a huge testing fan out of the Opus new AI Clip voiceover because, feature in Opus Clip. Um, not good. Because both the original video and the AI voiceover were playing at full volume, they were clashing and you couldn't hear either of them clearly. So what I actually recommend is clicking back on the voiceover, scrolling down and turning the original video down to 0% while the voiceover is playing. Let's generate that and see what it sounds like now. Hi, this is Greg, testing out the new AI voiceover feature in Opus Clip. And there we go, that fixes the problem completely. One other thing to mention now is that you can actually move the voiceover around within the video so that it doesn't have to just play at the start. I'll show you how to do that now. So you simply come down to the timeline where that voiceover has been added here and you can move this along anywhere on the timeline that you want. So you can have it play at the very end of the video, the outro, or at a select point within the video. So that's how you can now add an AI voiceover to your videos inside Opus Clip, if you're happy typing out the script for it. But what if you don't want to type out the script for your voiceover? What if you want Opus Clip to do that automatically for you. I'll show you how to do that now. So to start the process of having Opus Clip actually generate the AI voiceover script for you, you actually need to come out of the editor area and be at this area here where Opus Clip shows you the preview of your video after you've uploaded it. And what you need to do is click this button here, the add AI voiceover. And this time you'll see this voiceover screen, which is different to where we were before. On this screen, you can once again, choose your AI speaker voice by scrolling down through one of the 20 voices available to you here. And this time you get to choose the style of the script that is written for you. So you have some presets here you can choose from, serious, conversational, humorous being some of them. Let's go for casual this time. Next, you can choose whether to have Opus Clip write you a beginning hook for the start of your video or an ending call to action to go at the very end of your video. We'll keep it on beginning hook this time. And then by pressing this button here, generate AI voiceover, Opus Clip is going to analyze our video, understand what is being said within the video and write a hook to start the video off for us. So let's press that now and try that out. And after a few seconds of waiting, we see this screen with the opening hook that Opus Clip has written for us over on the left-hand side. We can see here it's written, hey, I love Opus Clip AI and it makes editing so fast and easy. Totally recommend. So what Opus Clip has done there is it has understood what I'm saying inside this video. This was a video of me talking about how great Opus Clip is. And it's written a short summary to be the opening voiceover of this video. Amazing because we can now add custom openers and closers to any of our videos that are tailored to exactly what is being said in that video without having to do any of the thinking ourselves. So now we have our script as before, if we just scroll down and turn the volume down to 0% and press the generate button to save, 
I can now press play and hear that opening hook to my video that was written completely by Opus Clip. Hey, I love Opus Clip's AI. It makes editing so fast and easy. Totally recommend. Easy as that. So now that you know how, make sure to check out the new AI voiceover tool inside Opus Clip yourself and let us know what you think to it in the comments below. We love to hear your feedback. Thank you Opus Clip for having me here once again. Here's a video I've made in the past that shows you how to automatically remove any pauses from inside your video. So what's that next as the next way of saving time when you're making your clips and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.